If you guys have better JTV, this is what my jack o' lantern looks like. You are a clear example of never making up user names while you are hungry. Patty. Got a new spell. Aqua Bomb. Oh, she finally has an offensive spell. That Swedish meatball, thank you. Who all? You seem to be having trouble finding your way around. It's okay. I'll figure it out eventually. I always do. This place is definitely confusing. I haven't been here though. Oh yeah, and after after Nintendo 64, I didn't really have any other consoles. I eventually got a PlayStation 2, but I never had a PlayStation 1. Anything else today? Maybe. I still got a lot of this game left. There's still a bunch of dungeons. I could probably go for a while. I don't feel tired at all. Some days I can barely open my eyes, I'm so tired. Oops, I do want to touch it. Antelo, thank you. I plan on getting me a future Xbox for PS4. Future Xbox? Is that an official name? I always thought they'd call it the Xbox 720 or something like that. Double 360. Oh no. no. That wasn't a teleporter. Emperor, thank you. Yeah, the next generation console. I went to college for a computer system technician, and when I was there, everybody had such a nice computer that I ended up getting my own for like 2500 I built it myself, and it was really good for that time, but that was about four years ago. So it's just kind of average now. I have it overclocked so much that it can be just as good as... The I series, like I five or whatever. That Swedish meatball, thank you. Level up. Love the level up. Antelope, thank you. New World of Warcraft expansion announced. Mists of Panned Area. I was. Aw, oh, damn it. You know what this is? I'm pretty sure this is the very start of the level. Just walk in a big circle. That Swedish meatball, thank you. New StarCraft 2 units announced. 
So with the StarCraft 2 units, does that mean multiplayer? Like new units in multiplayer games? So I'd be interested in seeing that. I don't really like playing StarCraft, but I do occasionally watch StarCraft uh, on Apple, Justin TV. Thank you. you play StarCraft Follow. I did for a bit, like when it first came out, and I just was so bad at it. I get frustrated. I'm not really that much of a competitive gamer. Okay. That was just leaving the area. Test readers meatball, thank you. HTTP colon slash slash edit dot com slash r slash starcraft slash Yeah, I played Starcraft for a while. In the first season I played it more. I didn't play it at all during the second season. I only got like ten games on the third season. I'm not sure where they're at right now. Antelo, thank you. I am not much of a strategist. Yeah, I was just not that good at it. I was okay when it first started. But all it would do was load up dropships with tanks and then sit behind uh, the enemy's minerals and siege up. But I never made it past gold lead. I think the highest I got was gold lead. I was saying I'm not really that competitive of a gamer. Because I get so frustrated when I lose. Antelope, thank you. For me, StarCraft is a modern day chess game. But I like watching uh, professionals do it. Koreans? That Swedish meatball, thank you. I am gonna get StarCraft 2 when I get my new PC. I'm probably gonna watch uh, BlizzCon this weekend with the GSL finals. I like seeing that. I like seeing people playing games over a lot of money at stake. Like a big prize for the winner when it's that competitive. You see sometimes the players are actually crying when they lose. That's how serious they take it. That Swedish meatball, thank you. The Koreans hate losing capital. <laughs> With Koreans, it's like their whole country's pride is StarCraft. Anybody would let their country down. But the Koreans are so serious about it. Antelope, thank you. What's capital? Is anybody here Korean? That's Peter's meatball, thank you. Stay capital with a capital K instead. Antelope, thank you. Maybe it will keep saying it. Yeah, because he's a troll. He likes trolling. I'm like, why you be trolling? But it's just the way some people are. It's like, hey, Hala, why haven't you been streaming? So lately. That's the reason you call. Thank you. Mom, I just like the face hat. Antelope, thank you. 
Battlefield 3 to offer early access to Mass Effect 3 demo. That's sweet as meatball, thank you. I am no troll. <laughs> Swift Rich. Trolling can be funny, but you gotta know who to troll. People who are quick to rage are the funniest. Meatball, thank you. Don't see the trolls. All it seems like Ampelo, thank you. Xbox. It seems like um sales hit 57 damn worldwide. The first page on Justin TV is pretty much nothing but trolls. Like yeah, if you go into one of those heavily populated channels, you'll see every line is somebody trolling pretty much. Unless it's uh something like man versus game where people actually have respect to the guy. Emperor, thank you. Blizzard has also announced that upcoming build a title, and we have a hand on your back as soon as possible, so stay tuned for more good pump excitement. Emperor, thank you. I go build a this team game. That's Swedish Meatball, thank you. Barn, do you streaming on Twitch? I am, yeah, it goes to both of them. If you stream on Justin TV, it goes to Twitch also. That's Swedish Meatball, thank I think. you. Now I am confused. But no, I'm on Justin TV. I don't understand this. This one never works. Maybe it needs to be activated or something. Everyone, thank you. I am always confused. <laughs> How is Dale Muter? You haven't been talking. How's it going? I just want you to say something because I like the way the boss is in there. I'm not sure if you're offended by it or not. Oh, you like it? But it always makes me laugh. I told you I'd reach level 40 before I figure out where I'm supposed to go. Antelope, thank you. While subscribers to get Diablo, I I I I I saw an ad that it said World of Warcraft is free. But the condition is you can only play free up until level 20. Once you hit level 20. Antelope, thank you. What makes me laugh is the girl singing in the midst of chaos. Yeah, I gotta get her back. I gotta figure out how to get off these docks. These are the most ridiculous docks. Like, why would they build this for boats? It goes all over the place. There aren't many games that have a dungeon like this, so where you're just on docks over the water. 